Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel of mine that it, this is. <laughs> um, so today we are gonna do another kind of springy time look. Um, it's gonna be a little more <laughs> glam than last time because I'm actually gonna go out and do stuff after this because I'm I'm like you know. What? I'm tired of doing all these makeup videos, and no one is able to appreciate it outside in the beautiful world. So, I mean, I'll bless the public with my face today. You know, once it's not looking like this. <laughs> so, let's get right into it. And today, since why not, I'm just gonna do the whole thing with my skincare and whatnot. So to prime, I'm going to go in with NYX Honey Do Me Up Primer and Serum. I love it because it's a primer and a serum. Yeah. Next, I'm taking my Beauty Blender and I'm taking the L'Oreal Paris Pro Matte Infallible Foundation in shade 102. And that is my shade, that is Shell Beige, and I'm putting that on my face. And now I'm taking my holy grail, the Tarte Shape Tape in Fair, because we're pale, and I'm gonna just do my under eyes and highlighting with that. Next, I'm gonna carve out my cheeks with my Sephora contouring brush, and I don't know if they make this anymore. Oops. Then I'm taking CoverGirl's bronzer in 245 Warm Beige. We're just gonna warm up these cheeks. Hi. And then I'm taking the nice super white powder and setting my face, cause I want to be white. And now I'm, that I'm Casper again, I'm going to take my Femme Couture eye primer and just do this to my lids. I'm not gonna put it on, I'm just gonna energize it. And now I'm going to take my Anastasia Dip Brow in Chocolate and I'm going to just kind of sketch out these brows quick. Screw the wings cutting people. These brows. Uh, daggers. Uh, I'm kind of trying a new brow thing. I mean, I just um, shaped them. So. <laughs> Angry Dawson. Sad Dawson. Excited Dawson. Okay, so today, since we're doing another spring look, I'm going to be going in with the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. I love this thing to death. Oh my god. I love smelling it, mainly. I have not really used it much, as you can kind of tell, but these colors are just so beautiful. Like, I would eat this. Actually, it doesn't taste good. Does not taste like peaches. Does not taste like peaches. Um, okay, so actually getting to the makeup now, I'm going to be taking um, white peaches and I'm going to be layering that all over my eyelid. So now I'm going to take puree and I'm going to just use that as a slight transition color. So now that I have puree on in my crease as a transition color, can we first just say how gorgeous that is? Like, I'm ready. Just kidding, I'm not ready. <laughs> um, next, I'm going to take Summer Yum, and I'm going to add that just to kind of warm it up, not that it needs it, but I just love this color, because just watch. It's like, so cute. Okay, so still taking the Sweet Peach palette, I'm going to be going into just peachy, and I'm going to put that on my lids. Okay, now that I have that on there, I'm kind of loving it. Just because it's like, I've got my warm outside, but then it's like, pop a peach. Um, so next, I'm going to take um, a little bit of Charmed, I'm sure, and I'm going to um, just deepen that crease because this kind of blended and made it like more neutral and then I'm like where'd my crease go though then I'm going to take Jeffree Star's Ice Cold and I'm going to highlight the inner corner and just add a little bit to the lid 
it wears. Um, I'll leave in the description box how it wore. That way you can read up and, like, see my true thoughts and all, like, the long wearing of mm. it. But as far as the way it looks, I love it. And all the products really worked out. I don't think that's ever happened to me. Okay, so now that I have, like, <laughs> the whole so eye highlighting thing so done, <laughs> I'm going to be taking Bless Her Heart, so and I'm going to um, use that to smoke out my bottom lash line. And hope that it goes for the best, because that is a green. Pray for me, people. So next, I'm just going to quick do my wings and my under black eyeliner. And I'll be right back here. Actually, you know what? I'm going to just finish my eyes with the liner and the lashes, too, because you all know how that's done and whatnot. If not, I'll make a video for you later. While I'm waiting for my lashes to dry, I'm going to quickly apply my blush, Milani Blossom Time Rose. I love this stuff way too much. Ugh. So pretty. So springy. So summery. So wintry. So folly. I'd use this anytime a year. Like, hey. She feels cute. So here's the cute little lashes and liner on. I'm feeling super cute right now. And then, so next, we're going to go in with something that everyone has been raving about, but I have yet to try because I'm always behind on everything. And it's the Wet n Wild highlighters. I was like, okay, they're they're cute. Like, seeing all these videos, I'm like, okay, they look good, they look good. Once I tried it, and I swatched it, I was like, oh! And it's four bucks. And I have it in Precious Petals, because that's the lighter one. The other one is kind of rose goldy, kind of on the darker side. I feel like it's still, like, gorgeous and blinding. I just haven't, I don't have it, and I haven't tried it. So we're going to use this as highlighter today. We're just going to... Go for it. Look at this highlight. Oh my god, this is four bucks. Given I like did have to build it a little bit, but it is so gorgeous. Honestly, kind of a dupe for Champagne Pop by Becca. I mean, four bucks? 38 bucks. I always love Becca. Definitely love all their highlighters <laughs> and their blushes and <laughs> everything by Becca. I love Becca. <laughs> but this one, seriously, worth. I'm shook. And now to finish this look, I'm going to go in with the NYX lingerie in the shade Bedtime Flirt. Because it's a nice, it'll very well complement my eyes because it's like kind of just a neutrally kind of like second like my only complaint about these lipsticks is they're drying on the lips and I like don't hold it against them but like when they dry they dry and now the final part which we all knew was coming because I'm actually leaving the house tonight so I actually get to enjoy this next part but we are taking our Makeup Forever Mist and Fix, and we are going to set this mug. <sighs> I'm not ready. Okay, I'm ready. <sighs> oh, that's nice. Oh, that's refreshing. Okay, so here you guys go. This is the final look. I'm kind of loving it. I'm loving just that. Every time I blink, I can like see like that pink 
and then we put on the lid, and I'm just like, Ooh, okay. It's different. It's different for me. I'm not used to ever doing this, and I like it. And obviously, gotta have that glow. And I'm loving the lip right now because it's like it just really brings it together. Cause it's neutral, but it's like another good thing about these like Nyx lingeries. They make my lips look so big. I'm like, mm, hi, no lip injections, cause we're not 18 yet, so we can't get those yet. So. It's a good thing we have that. <laughs> so, um, thank you guys so much for watching today. Um, I love you guys so, so much. Um, check out my other videos. Leave me a like. Leave me a comment. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that little bell button to get notified when I post. Since now, obviously, I'm going to be posting a lot more since this is the, like, first time in forever that I've actually posted two videos within a week of each other um that's a very rare thing now um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching now um i'm going to go out with my friend olivia who is here but does not want to be shown because she's an egg come say hi say hi come say hi say hi why aren't you saying hi that was weak I love you guys so much. Bye!